I could just picture the uh, N64 Smash Bros. Um, commercial with them skipping along. Oh yeah, just everyone's friendly. That's how we do. And they end up beating up, beating up each other. I oh. love that commercial. I just want this stage on a loop as like my background or something. Just like this nice music, the waterfall going, so, oh, so serene. I know. I love this stage. So how do you think of this matchup? So we're going to have a Rosalina versus a Bayonetta. Um, unfortunately for Rosalina, she doesn't have really confirmations into her kill options, which is just mostly uh, up smash or up air. So very susceptible to getting witch timed. But she has the hard hits where she can close out Bayo's stock early. So uh, it's all about how, if, how Zero is going to bait out with witch time and if Brigade can bait that bait out. You know what I'm saying? It's a chess match. Uh, what do you think? What do you think about this? Well, I think um, Brigade should still look out for Bayonetta when he's doing up airs because he could um, make him come closer to the uh, blast zone and ceiling, use Witch Twist and bring him up there instead. True. So you're saying that Brigade could get um, suffer from a reversal if he's trying to shark underneath and getting the up airs? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that is very scary. Good point. Good point. Looks yeah. like... Oh, go ahead. Oh. So, you know, whenever I face Bayo, um, when I do, when I use a character with good up air strings, I still need to be careful of the witch twist. Yeah, uh, if you are scared, you can kind of like try and remain a little bit lower, but still threaten with your up air from like a safer distance. But then again, it, you have to get the Luma hitbox most likely for Rosa to kill. So you know, there's only so much space you can give up. But we'll have to see if Brigade. Oh, oh, gets the air dodge. Dude. He, he baits out the witch twist, or I mean the the witch time or the air dodge right there, and gets rewarded. Oh, man, Luma. If only you were this strong in Super Mario Galaxy. Oh my gosh, they would have just beat Bowser by themselves. I know. <laughs> With that much knockback. I mean, Luma's already higher tier than Bowser in this game. It's it's just clear cut who's better. But Brigade holding down center stage so right now, getting. Uh, HID 0 up to 150. A raw up smash will do it. Suit. Oh, and the gentleman yeah. will do it, actually. Forget what I said about not having kill confirms. Jab 1, 2, 3 is a kill confirm. As long as you have Luma. That's True. Cool. And as long as they're up, like, 150. <laughs> oh, oh! that If he went down with him, that would have been it. Yeah. But Soul into down air on the, the Smash Form platform would have just destroyed Brigade stock right there. Yeah. Oh, there goes Luma again. Nice dash attack just for the small percent of, what, like 10% from that throw. So pretty, pretty worth it if he can convert his kill while Luma's gone. You know, because you can't take too many of those trades to kill Luma because then you're just going to start getting too far up there, you know? Mm -hmm. Good good run away and then turn around punished by Brigade there for the, the heal slide. Oh, oh, whoa. There we go. Zero finally landing on the stage, getting his hit. Hitting Luma into free fall. Oh, Luma. The assist. Good up there. Nice grab. Oh, wind oh. with the air dodge again, but... Looks like Zero's getting back in the stage right now. That's going to separate Luma, but the platform oh, there... Okay. okay. Nice clean up there. Oh. You need, this is a chance to close out the stock, but a lot of <laughs> a lot of spaghetti. <laughs> okay, that's okay, that, that. Okay, smash roll definitely gonna lead to that kill. Brigade taking his time. This game is already halfway over on the timer. Brigade, no stranger to getting a timeout, so yeah, he's okay with playing this a little bit slower. There's a nice punish there on the grab, but. Oh, zero with the mash out of the grab. Oh Ooh. no, this oh, is Oh my huge. goodness, this is. Oh! Both of these characters want to jank off the top, so let's see who gets it. Oh, yes, definitely. Oh, that was a nice... Uh, I don't know what that's called. I forget what that's called. The, the dash in with the hitbox of Luma with the grab of Rosa. I yeah. forget what that's called. I think... I wonder if it works the same way as Dacus. I, I'm not sure. I'm not like sure Like, the way, either. you know, the button presses are. I uh, know. It's probably way less... Uh, intensive then attack is. Maybe, I don't know. Because um, I can Ooh. still... Oh, man. Spot dodges it. He's going straight mistake over here, trying to get that raw forward smash. Is this mistake versus 
Um, who am I trying to think of? Uh, the good, the good. Was it? The buzz, the buzz. Oh, the buzz. And he gets oh, the back and kill. Ooh. He knew that Brigade likes to go hop off the ledge and get the down there, but Zero is already waiting at the perfect range to get the back air off of that option. Ugh. Good stuff there by Zero. Really remaining resilient. Survival. Brigade taking that L on game one. Best of three right now, so Zero can clutch it up out this next game. He's good to go. Three, two, We're back in one, Smashville. Go. Yeah, like we saw, good for Bayo getting those sideways kills with the back air or the attempted forward smash. But uh, Brigade does offer Luma a platform to land on if she goes in the free fall, so good for both players here. Good grab. Okay. Zero didn't do anything during that time. I feel like uh, the way Brigade has been getting a lot of his percentage in this match is uh, just shield grabbing Zero's options. Like heal slide or just like landing unsafe on the, on the shield. Yeah, I slowly learned that Bayonetta actually doesn't have Ooh. that much of a good... Oh. Oh, what? Oh, he drops it. Oh, yeah, um, Bayonetta's um, neutral is actually not that good, to be honest. Like, um, a lot of her, um, you know, a lot of Bayonetta's would try to get in with the um, heal slide. Yeah, and it gets blown up uh, from time. Yeah, like some people would wait until she does, like, you know, the... When she swings her uh, foot like that. Yeah, yeah, the kick. But you can actually just, like, you know... Once she hits you, you can either do down smash or up smash out of shield. Yeah, yeah. I mean, talking about Bale's neutral, you know, she usually gets the combo started with, like, a, a great move such as a witch twist. It's such a big hitbox, comes out very fast. Or um, a down tilt. No way. Oh, no. I thought that was going to kill. Well, that's that, not going to kill. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Rip. Rosalina doesn't have to worry about getting sent off stage from the up B like most characters. She has a great recovery. As long as she mixes up the timing, she can make it back to ledge. Punish? Okay. No punish. Oh, but... Whoa! Brigitte also doesn't rip anything in return, but because Luma wasn't there yeah. to get the strong hit of anything, but still, could have forced smash him off stage. You know, you never... I mean, maybe he doesn't want to um, steal it. Steal the move. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. Oh, all the cross-ups. Yeah, I think... Uh, Zero leaving himself a little bit open sometimes. Brigade not quick enough with the punishes. But let's see if... Whoa! Oh, Brigade backing off the ledge, letting Luma be the buffer right oh, there. Good the stuff oh. by Zero. Gets the blue. Seeing the opportunity to just switch time right on off the ledge. Knowing Brigade is going for one of his hard hits, like he usually closes out stocks with. That's just a good player knowledge right there because Brigade has not been going for very hard hits on the ledge, but Zero knows as a player, Brigade closes out stocks with like forward smash when people are getting off the ledge. Whoa! Oh. I mean, I would not oh, expect to DI that way since <laughs> Ro um, Rosa's on the left side. 320 damage off of that grab. Must be nice. Yeah, here's the punish. Whoa, when he hits him with that up there. This is how Brigade turns it into his favor, getting this high lead right now. Nice reversal there by Zero, not exactly closing it out though. The cross up caused Brigade to miss his shield grab. Zero scouting off for that option again. Let's see if Brigade goes for the rise off down there again because Zero has been looking for it. Brigade backing off, trying to get, try to buy some time to get Luma back. Yeah, very evasive, rolling around right now, rolling through his opponent as he runs at him. I mean, I'm noticing that um, he, he thought he was going to roll away. Oh, there goes Luma again. That's so good oh. for Zero right now. Luckily, no. Brigade... Yeah. What? Yes, he he used up his jump during um his combo. Oh, no. He also used side B, so wow. he, he was too far away to make it back. She's brain knowing much more about this character's movement than I do, knowing that Zero has already done so. Brigade's... The Brigade just taking a moment knowing that that was a very lucky way yeah. to close out that game. But the thing about that was that Brigade had lost Luma, but he was only at 50%. So he was very much in the uh, the safe range of not dying to any like random hits or anything. All he would have to do was avoid combos. 
you know, he, L Luma would have been back on deck soon without Brigade have dying beforehand. So, you know, that game was not lost, even though Brigade was, you know, having some trouble there at the end. But, <laughs> but I mean, he did have the lead when zero SD too. So there's that factor, but uh, yeah. wow. So unfortunate Brigade even knows that, man, that must be pretty lame. Yeah. Overextended a little too much. <laughs> and we were saying before on commentary that Zero is a nutty player. So, no, oh my gosh! <laughs> the disrespect character switch! <laughs> the disrespect! Fight me. He knows that Brigade hates fighting Meta Knight, but in that hate, he has crafted a play style that will help him in this matchup. The hate has borne this style of play right here, where Brigade stays by the ledge and says, you need to come to me right now, damn it. And I'm gonna get these little hits, so you have to come into me even more. You yeah. have much yet, you have much yet to learn. Yeah, look, Brigade was so close to the edge right there, Zero just had to cash it out with an up smash. Like, this is the, oh, wow. Oh, wow, <laughs> Okay, just stood there. Right there already is a huge difference between Zero and our actual Meta Knight main, Wing It. Wing It is very more dash in, dash out. So when Brigade ran in with that grab, he was expecting Zero to have moved or dashed into him. But uh, Zero playing so much more patient than Wing It in terms of movement options. Yeah. This won't lead into much. And this is the play style. Luma, the yep. platform. Platform save Luma. Brigade instantly rolling back to the ledge. He knows he cannot afford to get dash attacked uh, towards the middle of the stage. It's just, it's instant death. And he's playing it that way too. This is the game we play right now. This is the matchup we play. Unfortunately, Zero not confirming most of his uh, his dash attack into like, he'll probably get a few up airs before he needs to retreat back to stage, but he's missing out some percentage. Oh, no tech. Oh, but he still makes it. Yeah, luckily Brigade is at, lo at low percent. Didn't get too up punished hard from the no tech. Rosal's up B is quite good, so she'll make it back. Yeah, she will. Nice ro read on the roll right now. Zero counterpicked this character game three, but he's not getting much of his conversions though, unfortunately. <gasps> Reason air dodge, he can't oh, up me though. Why did he, he do that? Extended, and he no, fast fell too. He thought he had the platform for security. So he, he went in right there big to get the stock to land on the platform, but just barely missed it. That's why he went for it. Yeah, and he also fast fell too. Yeah, he fast fell to try and get away from Brigade's punish, most mm. likely. Do you think if he didn't fast fall, he would have more time to drift to the ledge? Okay. Yes, okay. yes. He would. So Brigade probably smiling quite big inside right now, knowing that this matchup is this match is going in his favor at the moment. But anything could be death right now. Luckily that was not a down throw into combo. <laughs> Everyone rolling behind each other. Is they this see me rolling! Oh, oh he could have actually just dodge rolled out of there. It canceled. It you know what? Canceled. I think Zero, someone at Genesis did that and like destroyed someone. I think Zero been watching someone at Genesis right there. I can't remember who it was. Going for the swag kill. Wow, and, and that's the kill. Oh. Brigade very frustrated with that, knowing that his lead is basically out the window at the moment. You need the shield of having two stocks against Meta Knight because now he's so open to dying. When Meta Knight's at a certain height during his vanishing cape, it cancels. <gasps> oh man, that nearly killed. I almost, I almost died right there. Just like Zero. Uh, I mean, Meta Knight's a pretty light character, so Zero needs to be real careful against Lumo. Brigade can literally die at Zero here oh. to a combo. He can literally die. Oh, but Brigade is just... Zero's definitely losing patience right now. Yes, yes. He's getting punched for it right now. Oh, and he oh, makes the he... jump away! Wow, Brigade going very aggressive in his one opening right there. Oh, so smart, getting a JV2.